Okay, so here's how you can move your Steam games between computers, or even Steam Decks for that matter. So, just to kind of show how you can use this with either device, I'm going to be transferring a game that's on my Steam Deck to my desktop computer. But this will work between computers, between Steam Decks, etc. as long as you own the game. So if you're messing with your Steam Deck, the first step is to go to desktop mode. The only thing that's really a necessity for this is a USB hub and a hard drive. But if you're going between two desktop computers, you shouldn't need a USB hub. But for the case of a Steam Deck, you'll need a USB hub to connect your hard drive. Hard drive size isn't really anything specific, as long as it's big enough to fit the game that you're trying to move. This is a 2 terabyte, so, you know, something like that is more than big enough, especially for a couple games. Now, on the Steam Deck, you'll have to hit Mountain Open. First step is to find the game that you want to move off of the first device. So, let's just say I want to move Terraria off of this device onto my other device. The first step is to find that game on the Steam Store, specifically the Store page not the game in your library. See, once I find Terraria right here, I go and click on Store Page, and then you'll right-click, or if you're using Steam Deck, left trigger, and hit Copy Page URL. Once you have the page URL, simply open up your notepad. The reason that we need the page URL is because this is the name of a file that you have to move. And to know exactly what file you need, you simply need to copy the name of it. So, right-click or left trigger and hit Paste. And then we can see right here that the Terraria file is 105600. I think I'm reading that right. So what you do is you'll copy this and then go to the drive that your game is on. So for me, it's the SD card, but if it's on your main drive, it'll be in a slightly different location. Go to the Steam Apps folder. Once you're in the Steam Apps folder, you can hit the magnifying glass or the search button and then paste in that little code that you had from your game from earlier. And that'll find the exact file that we need to move over. So this one right here is the app manifest for Terraria. If you look at the number, or like I said, you can search for it specifically, but if we click on it, we can see the word Terraria in there. So that's absolutely the right one. So what you're gonna do is take this file and just move it anywhere on your USB drive. Just, I'm gonna move it onto the root of the drive, not in a folder, but just move it onto your USB drive so that you'll have it for later. So I'll hit copy here. So basically the point of this file is if this file is on your computer, it'll make the game appear in your Steam library. So you can hit play in your Steam library or make shortcuts. However, if you don't have this file, you can only open the game from the EXE basically. It'll still recognize that you own it, it just won't put it in your library as a game is downloaded. So now we go from the Steam Apps folder into the Common folder, and the Common folder is in the Steam Apps folder, so we just go a little further. Then you find the game that you want. So for example, I want Terraria. See Terraria is right here. I take the entire Terraria folder, and then copy it to my hard drive. Once you're done moving files to your drive, you know, make sure the file transfers are done and you can unplug it and move it to your second computer or second Steam Deck, whatever it is that you're using. So our copying is finished, so I'm gonna unplug it and move to my desktop. So essentially you take this at manifest folder and go to the Steam Apps folder on the drive of your choice and you drag it over into here, which I already did just a moment ago. And then once you're in the Steam Apps folder, you continue into your common folder. And then in the common folder, you just take the entire game folder and drag it over into the common folder, which I already did off camera. So this is a slower Xbox hard drive I have, but as soon as it's done, it'll just be ready to play. If you have Steam open, whether you have a game open or Steam is updating, I would recommend going to your taskbar and fully closing Steam and then reopening it for the changes to take effect. Okay, so now Terraria is transferred to this desktop computer, so I'm reopening Steam. So you can see if I go to my library and click on Terraria, the play button is green, it doesn't say download anymore. Give it a second, and now Terraria is opening. Of course, you'd use this on larger games, um, not a game like this with a super small file size. I just use this for demonstration, but that is how you can move your Steam games between... PCs or even Steam Decks for that matter. As you saw, I used my Steam Deck for this. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you on the next one. That's all from me. I'm out. Peace.